And thanks for staying with us. You're still watching us. We're briefing now to the rest of the stories. The Police Officers' Wise Association, POA, in continuation of its 2023 convention, empowered over 400 women as a means of providing life-changing support to struggling women of the association. The association, known for its commitment to the welfare of police officers' families, distributed sewing machines and other valuable items at the POA International School in Gurki, Abuja. Speaking at the event, the First Lady of Nigeria Mrs. Oluwemi Tinibu, who was represented by the wife of the Imo State Governor, Barista Chioma Uzodima, expressed the commitment of, to supporting the wives of fallen heroes within the police force, acknowledging the economic challenges posed by the current situation in the country. We not only celebrate our shared commitment to unity, but also embrace the responsibility to uplift those who have faced the harsh realities of loss. This empowerment program is more than a gesture of goodwill. It is a pledge to make a tangible, tangible difference in the lives of over 100 widows of police officers who have served our great nation. The provision of sewing machines, grinders, dryers, and other tools given today are seen soon to help you to be self-reliant and feed your family. President of POA, Mrs. Elizabeth Ebertokun, emphasized the importance of skills development for women, stressing that acquiring viable skills is crucial for securing a significant place in the society. Empowerment is not merely a concept. It is a force that can redefine lives. Our women of wisdom deserve more than sympathy. They deserve active support. Genuine empowerment, acknowledgement, and celebration of their skills. Today, together, let us create an environment where their voices resound. Their skills are celebrated. Minister of State for Police Affairs, Mrs. Iman Suleiman, reiterated the present administration's unwavering support for the Nigerian police while emphasizing the importance of encouraging the police force in the discharge of their constitutional duties. You can see that as women, we continue to contribute from every angle to nation building. I need to applaud you for your patriotism. Please continue to sacrifice. It will pay, it will count. For people who um, kind of um, focus on our challenges as a force. I ask them to just close their eyes and imagine one hour without the Nigerian police force and then they come back to their senses knowing that the Nigerian police force continue to do little and a lot with a little. So this administration will give them so much so that they're able to, you know, support and perform their constitutional duties. The distribution of the items is expected to take place in batches, benefiting over 400 women, an initiative by POWA that reflects its ongoing commitment to uplifting the wives of struggling officers and making a positive impact on the lives of women association associated with the police force.